single muscle loosening and relaxing, loosen and relaxing, loosen and relaxing. Sleep deep asleep, all the way down, deep asleep, like a rag doll. Every muscle loosen, just like a bundle of rags. Loosen them. Five, four, three, two, one. Keep drifting down deeper and deeper. With each and every breath you take, let every muscle loosen and unwind. Many people report they can feel the muscles in their feet and legs loosening and relaxing. A lot of people say they can feel the tension just draining out of the bottoms of their feet. Let yourselves relax deeper and deeper with each and every breath you take. Deeper and deeper with each and every breath you take. So relaxed and so comfortable. And I know you're feeling relaxed and comfortable now. However, I'm going to show you a way in which you can become 10 times more relaxed. 10 times more relaxed than you are right now. And here's how we're going to do that. In just a minute, I'm going to start slowly counting backwards from five down to one. And whatever number I count, it's going to take you deeper into this wonderful relaxation. You're going to feel your muscles loosening and relaxing, getting more comfortable, more relaxed, more unwound, so deep, so relaxed, that by the time I reach the number one, by the time I reach number one now, every single muscle from the top of your heads to the tips of your toes is going to be totally, deeply, completely, wonderfully relaxed. Your first name, Adam. Carol. Carol, would you pick a spot on that balloon and just keep your eyes on it? Please don't take your eyes off until I ask you. You folks are concentrating perfectly. We're going to begin this process with a very deep breath. Would you take a nice deep breath for me, please? Breathe in deeply. That's it. And as you exhale, slowly drop down five. Just let your legs and feet go limp again. Deep, 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 deep sleep all the way. Very loose, very relaxed. How are you, madam? I'm good. You're good. I apologize. There are no name tags here today. What did you say your first name was? Bob. Your first name is? Bob. Are you sure? I'm Bob. You're Bob. Thirstier and thirstier, too, with each passing second. It's Gabriel, is it? Gabriel? Gabriel? Um, you seem to have misplaced a shoe somewhere along the line, Gabriel. Did you come up here with two of them? Did you lose it? Is it around here somewhere? Well, did you just come up with one shoe? No? Well, could you try to find it for me? It's kind of important that you locate if you can. Madam, what's your first name? Anna. Anna. And how do you feel? Good. Okay. And sir, are you thirsty? Well, what do people do when they're thirsty? You don't know what? Can't find the place to drink from. Well, let me ask you this. Do you have young children by any chance? All right, look at me for just a second. You know the game you play with young kids? These are your ears, these are your eyes, this is your nose, right? Where's your mouth? Are you really thirsty? And your name is? Are you sure of that? I, I live up in uh, Central Florida, in Melbourne, but there's a casino around here, is there not? Isn't there some place in Hollywood or something, some kind of a casino? Do you ever go to a casino? You're you a gambling person? You ever place a bet? Not really. Not? I got a bet you might be interested in. I'll, I'll bet you $500 that your name is not Bob. Would you take that bet? In other words, I will bet you $500. What's your name? Bob. Would you bet $500 on it? You would. So uh, I would bet you 500 that your name is not Bob. You would be betting 500 that your name is Bob. Would you take that bet? Yes. Would you shake on it? Bef before you shake. Who do you know in this room really well? Do you have a friend or an associate that you know very, very well? Yes. Uh, would you point to that Lori. person? Where is she? Ma'am, would you stand up for just a moment, please? Would you honestly tell this young lady what her name is? Carl. What's your name? Bet five hundred dollars on it. Before you bet, Corey, it, don't you know my name? <laughs> is that her briefcase or purse or whatever? Did you bring a purse with you, ma'am? Identification. Would you have any objections to your friends bringing your purse or up here for identification? I want you to take a look at your driver's license and tell me what it says. I thought you were thirsty. Extreme. Extreme. I, if, if I gave you twenty bucks, would you take a drink? You just can't. Can't what? Can't. Don't know where your mouth is. I think this guy's in hypnosis. What do you think? New York Life is the company for me.
would you do me a favor? Would you take a moment and just locate your driver's license or any form of identification? If I gave you 50 bucks, would you take a drink? Can't find your mouth. That's got to be awful. What does what your driver's license say? Carol. It says Carol. Is that your picture? Yes. Is that your last name? Is that your last name? Mom? Yeah, okay. Is that your address? Is that where you live? Yes. Okay, so what's your name? What's your name? This is, this is St. Carol. Well, what is your name? Are you sure? <laughs> you didn't think you could be hypnotized, did you, sweetie? Thought it was impossible, didn't you? Were you awake when I, when I shot that guy with the sleep gun? Were you awake when that happened? Which guy? The guy that I shot. Well, I'll show you here. The, the guy that whenever I say hypnosis. Do you guys come with me? That guy. <laughs> Watch what I did. I, I have him so that if I, if I shoot him with this gun, he falls into a deep hypnotic sleep. Just get, take a look at him for a second. Oh, sir. <laughs> Pretty wild, huh? Now, eyes went up to the count of five, one, two, three, five. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, hypnosis. Your life's coming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> this is a sleep gun. You shoot people with this gun, they go into a deep hypnotic sleep. You don't believe that, do you? Crazy. I'm crazy? What's, what's your name? Bob. Absolutely. You still want to bet $500 on that? Yeah. Before, you do, before you do that, wait a second. Do you want to bet me $500 or you need, what's your name? Bob. Uh-oh. <laughs> what's your name? Bob. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> Sleep, wait, that is. Sound of five, your name is back to normal. One, two, three, five, five. Whoa, wide awake. Name's Carol, it's kind of high. One, two, five, wide awake. First name is? What's your name? Carol. Are you sure? Yeah. Well, you just get ready to bid me $500, your name is Bob. Not a chance, right? <laughs> you look really thirsty. Let me take that away for you there. You, watch this, it'll be fun. Now, tell me the truth. Do you think you can be hypnotized? Be honest. <laughs> <laughs> Forgot about that. Um, you, you keep looking over to your right. Is something going on on your right hand side? Okay. Whoa! You drank the whole bottle, didn't you? Well, would you all sit back in your chairs for just a moment? You guys are excellent, excellent, excellent. Find your shoe now. One, two, three. There you go. Would you all look at me for just a moment, please? Carol, yes. put your purse down. Uh, I don't want to spill on the floor. How are you guys doing? You all feel okay? Are you hypnotized? No. Hypnosis. You guys come to me. <laughs> Y'all look at me for just a moment. Take a nice deep breath. Breathe in deeply. Breathe in deeply. Beautiful. Sleep. Wait. Sleep, 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 sleep. Loosen it. Well, a round of applause for these guys. They're excellent. I got to get out of here. Deeper, deeper. How much is five plus two? How much is four plus three? Give me a hundred bucks, you tell me how much four plus three is. Please take a lesson. Excellent hypnotic subject. Still doesn't think she was hypnotized. A lot of you folks are going to go home and do this and think it's not working. I can't be hypnotized. It's not going to work on me. And much to your surprise, it's going to work. Even if you are an excellent subject, often people don't realize how effective it really is. So why not just go home and try it for a couple of weeks? Suspend your judgment. At the end of a few weeks, look back and ask yourself if you're any closer to the goal. It really does work. And you know, how much, five plus two, I forget. How much is five plus two? Seven. Yeah. Thank you very much, folks. Hope you're doing this. Thank you. You don't get to keep those. <laughs>